tonight on Sunday Night Heat. Mr. S versus Jeff Hardy. Welcome to the first match of the WWF WrestleMania 2000 tournament. And I cannot imagine a better way to kick this off with Senor Gulu himself, Mr. Ass, Badass, Billy Gunn, the man who is obsessed with ass. A notion that everybody can get behind. Only in the WWF can somebody see a career resurgence in their mid-30s by going on about their obsession with ass. Billy Gunn has taken his obsession one step further. He's even writing a book about his love of ass with an extensive chapter as to the greatness of how one picks their ass. But enough of that crap. Here comes Jeff Hardy, the extreme one. So extreme, he's always finding ways to bust himself up just to get some stuff. And apparently that's a little too touchy. So whatever, I'm not going to touch that. Jeff Hardy's looking pretty stoic and a little rigid as he's walking to the ring. Perhaps he's intimidated by Mr. Ass and his magnificent backside. As the tournament begins, Jeff Hardy goes straight to Mr. Ass and hits him on the back. But Mr. Ass isn't having that crap. As he tries to suplex, kicks him in the nuts, punches him, knocks him on his ass. Slaps him across the chest. Knocks him down again. Not gonna let Jeff Hardy take advantage. Jeff Hardy misses a spinning heel kick. Jeff said he studied the previous tournament extensively and especially the moves of the great Alex Wright. It clearly shows right there with the miss spinning heel kick. Blocks it. Mr. Ass knocks him right on his ass again. And he misses yet another spinning heel kick. The backdrop. Mr. Ass shoots right back up from that. He misses a clothesline. But he catches him with the elbow. Off the rope. He ducks. He's gonna hit him. I honestly don't have a damn clue what Mr. Ass is going for right there as he misses yet another clothesline. Oh, what a disrespectful punch! Right in the middle of his face! Oh, Jeff Hardy stays on the ropes. Mr. Ass hits him with a back body drop. A much better looking back body drop. As Jeff Hardy misses again. That's three missed spinning wheel kicks. Perhaps he's trying to break the record for missed spinning wheel kicks. As he rolls out of the way like a weasel. As he gets reversed into Oh, multiple crotch chops for Mr. Ass, showing no respect to Jeff Hardy. It locks him. Oh! And then he hits him with the famous sir! That's gotta be it! As he's not moving at all. One, two. Oh, Jeff Hardy unbelievably kicks out and stops this match from being a squash. As you can see, he brought out his brother Matt, but Matt is too busy bickering with the audience, telling them how much he hates Lita. It's been like 10 years, dude. You really need to get over that crap. As Jeff Hardy's trying to weasel his way out of the ring. Oh, oh, and he hits him with a springboard drop kick. What a beautiful maneuver there. Mr. Ass didn't like that as he tries to kick him, and he hits him with an enziguri. Jeff Hardy's down, but let's look at this again. Bam! That certainly did some damage to Mr. Ass, if you can believe it. His heart is down in his ass again. Oh, another beautiful chop by Mr. Ass. Oh, Jeff Hardy responding with an enziguri of his own. And Mr. Ass missing yet another clothesline. Looks to be his own version of the spinning heel kick. Oh, as he delivers a missile dropkick of his own. I did not expect these men to have such a back and forth. Hitting each other with the same moves. Certainly surprising and entertaining to watch. Mr. Ass showing how athletic he is. Delivers another back body drop. Oh no, he hits the knee. That's the same knee he kicked about a minute ago. He might be working on that. Doesn't want Jeff Hardy doing any more high flying moves. Oh, what a military press drop right there. Such, such a display of his magnificent ass muscles. Oh, the Hardy hits him with an enziguri. And he misses yet another clothesline. 
fast comes. Oh, and he drops him right on his ass. Kicks him in the chest, and he misses his drop kick. He grabs a hold. Oh, what? A jumping pile driver! That's gotta be it for Hardy. Oh, what's his ass going for? Oh! Oh, and he misses the massive load leg drop. And he's out. Out for that. The impact. What's the. Shot right through his body. Hardy throws him on his back again. And Mr. S stays where he is. He's not going to let Jeff Hardy flip him on his ass again. Hardy hits him with a chin breaker. And he goes to work on Mr. S's leg. Neither man showing any signs of being injured yet. Shoulder breaker. Jeff Hardy's getting pumped up right here. Grabs a hold, jumps up. Oh, and a spinning hurricane right up in! One, two, oh, and it kicks out. I can guarantee that is not the kind of ass the Mr. Ass will be writing in his book. Missing yet another clothesline, but he follows it up with a chop. Oh, Jeff already gets out of a German suplex! Mr. Ass is quick to recover as he shifts his ass out of the way. But he locks in a sleeper hold! Jeff Hardy's lungs aren't that great, he might actually have them here! Oh, Jeff Hardy gets out of it. Oh, blocks it, blocks it. Hardy blocks it. Oh, knocks Mr. Ass down again. He's picking him up. I really was not expecting Hardy to take it to him as he delivers a spinning neck breaker. And he misses another clothesline. Oh, and Jeff Hardy weasels his way out of that suplex. Oh, so they both miss a spinning heel kick, and oh, and he actually connects with a spinning heel kick. Oh, and he hits him again into the turnbuckle. Oh, Jeff Hardy's getting pumped here, kicks him to the apron. What's he gonna do here? He's got it, he's got it. Oh, ass is gone, he gets up, he grabs, he goes for it, he gets, what? That has gotta be some of the worst coordination I have ever witnessed in my entire life. Hardy's going back up to the ropes again. Oh, and he hits him with the flip, but he just barely nicks Mr. Ass on the nose. And he locks in the sleeper hold again! Sneaks that right in there, come on! Oh, Hardy gets out of that one. Mr. Ass throws him off the ropes, comes back. Oh, sweet merciful crap! What a clothesline! Why the hell would Hardy get up for that? Mr. Ass shows his impeccable ass, and you can hear the ladies crying through the, out the audience as they pass out. Well, let's look at this again. Oh my god, I swear he knocked the weed out of him. Oh, Mr. S hits him in the knee again. Not gonna let Jeff Hardy fly anymore for the rest of this match. I can guarantee that. Oh, just looks so effortless when Mr. S does that move. Hardy getting up yet again. Ass throws him off the ropes. Oh, and he hits him with the donkey punch. That's gotta be it. One, two, oh, how did Jeff Hardy kick out of that one? Oh, Mr. Ass is not liking that. He's going to start delivering it to him here. Oh, blocks it. Gives him a nice little love tap on the face. Hits him on the back. Oh, multiple crotch chops. I think we all know, know what's coming here. He spins him around. Grabs him. He's going. Yep, it's a famous sir. Oh, Jeff Hardy doesn't know where he is. And Matt Hardy certainly does not give a crap. Two, three, Mr. Ass wins. The Ass Man moves on to the second round of the tournament. What a great match to kick this thing off. Let's look at this again. Such elevation. Such display of athleticism. Now, ladies are starting to recover here. Mr. Ass bends over the video and the women fall right back to the ground. This does Jeff Hardy's face in this replay. He doesn't have a goddamn clue where he is right there. Oh, that was it. Let's get one more shot right here. Just look at this. Slow motion. Yup, and he, bam, right off the mat and off the knee. Not knowing where he is is something that Hardy's certainly used to. We'll see you all tomorrow night on Raw as Gangrel 
the douchebag vampire goes off against the billion dollar prince, Shane McMahon. <laughs>